you're watching this week's Reality Wrap. Let's get into a brand new episode of Hustle and Soul. Ladies, can I serve dessert before we start the appetizer and get into the main entree? We got Lawrence and the twins in the gym. Talk about a hot chocolate sundae. A little bit of light bright sprinkled in with that. Mm. Listen, we TV bring me to New York. I need a special trip to the pink tea cup because I need to get the tea. This week's messy menu, Lawrence is a mess. We see Candace showing Sanaa text message. He done sent her talking about he gonna get her an apartment. He gonna bring her some money. He knows she didn't steal nothing. He wanna make sure she feel better. He also said I was gonna give you some money anyway. I and see. All I get your hair and nails done. He also said I love you. He be telling me to come by when Anna not there. Different things you say to your boo when you messed up and you try to get some more butt. I'm just calling it like I see it. This week's Kitchen Chaos, Lawrence is telling his mother, Mama Pearl, about what's been going on in the restaurant, and she finally lays the law down. You're the boss, and they work for you. And when you work for somebody, you have to follow orders. And if they can't follow your orders, then you're going to have to look for someone else, because you don't want to go down, you want to go up. I tell them that, Ma. Like if they... you can't do it, let me come in, because I keep it real. Right, right. This week's recipe for disaster, Lawrence means well. We thought that the flowers originally were for a proposal to Anna. Eh, wrong. He's bringing the flowers as a symbol of him wanting to get a Michelin star. That would put the pink teacup with some of the elite restaurants in the New York area. And so he decides he wants to take the staff of the pink teacup to some of these five-star restaurants to see how they operate, to see what their presentation is like, just to see what the overall look and feel and ambiance is. I don't think this is a good idea, not with him putting Anna in charge of inviting people. Sorry I'm late. Sorry I'm Drop late. Drop down, try that caviar, it's amazing. Okay. <laughs> oh, she's not as ghetto as usual. I guess she must have borrowed a dress for this occasion. Hey, boo. Hey, Dom. Why are you late, Candace? I wasn't really informed. You wasn't informed? Whoever you advised to tell me didn't tell me. This week's hottest fisheries moment, they in this nice five-star classy restaurant. Lawrence is trying to do them a favor by educating them, letting them see what a five-star restaurant operates like and what the financial possibilities could be for this group. And they in here beefing. I mean, Thandy and Anna are throwing so much shade at Candace. I can't even see the menu is so shady in here, girl. Do you want to try it before they come back in and take it away? Mm. Come on, Candace, you like free food. <laughs> Anna, please. I'm just trying to educate and inform. You have to be educated to educate and inform. Stop it. But wait a minute. Let's rewind for a minute. Lawrence gave Sandy a second chance. Lawrence, what kind of boyfriend are you? You just disrespected me like I don't even exist. In that moment, I was thinking of myself. Moment, your moment got nothing to do with this business. She plays a vital role in a pink teacup. She deserves another shot. You done let Thandy swing on your girl, pull her hair, call her all types of names, and you gonna hire her back and let her work in the restaurant on top of her not being able to count to keep up with the orders? How, Sway? Hey guys, let's keep the social conversation going. Make sure you use the hashtag hustle and soul or tweet me at Mr. Ray, M I S S T E R R A Y. And as always, this is Reality Rap, and you're watching it right here on WeTV.